With Resident Alien Season 4 confirmed and on the way, speculation can begin in earnest regarding what will happen when the story continues. The ending of Resident Alien Season 3 provided several cliffhangers, although some were much more dramatic than others. While some prospective Season 4 events may seem inevitable, others can only be gently implied by recent events. Regardless, Resident Alien Season 4 is bound to be an action-packed affair that's dense with exciting plots. Resident Alien Season 3's reduced episode count suggested it would be the show's final run, but after a network switch, the story of Alan Tudyk's Harry Vanderspiegel will carry on for at least another season. The Resident Alien cast will likely remain largely the same in Season 4, although it would be surprising if one or two new figures didn't also enter the fray to keep things fresh. Either way, it's set to be a brilliantly bumpy ride. Harry Vanderspiegel will escape from the greys almost immediately in Resident Alien Season 4. Resident Alien can't leave its main character sidelined for too long. Resident Alien Season 3's finale, Homecoming, concluded with Tudyk's character trapped aboard the Grey Star Wars-inspired moonship along with his child, Bridget. With the shapeshifting mantid taking Harry's place on Earth, it may be a while before anyone notices he's even missing. However, the reveal of Harry being impersonated by the nefarious insectoid has already been and gone. So, Resident Alien Season 4 can't get away with leaving the Real Harry sideline for too long. An incarcerated main character can work well in some scenarios, but the way Resident Alien Season 3 ended, leaving Harry and Bridget trapped for too long would make for some very dull storytelling. Tudyk's character may not be able to immediately return to Earth, but it's unlikely Harry will accept his fate and remain imprisoned by the Grey Aliens. Max Hawthorne will be held captive by the Mantid. Resident Alien Season 4's new villain can masquerade as Max to cover for his absence. Max was last seen being forced to apologize to Harry at the end of Resident Alien Season 3. When it turns out that Max is actually knocking on the Mantid's door, Resident Alien Season 4's new villain presumably took action to avoid Max escaping and spreading the word. One possible solution would be for the Mantid to kill Max, as the bad guy has already proven to be capable of murder. However, this would be an incredibly dark twist for a show like Resident Alien. What's far more likely is that the Mantid will kidnap Max, and possibly Sahar, who was with Max at the time, and return periodically to patients to try and convince Max's parents and the other residents that nothing is amiss. In fact, the Mantid taking other characters' forms in general could be a frequent occurrence in Resident Alien Season 3, which has the potential to become very confusing, but in a way that makes the plot more compelling.